Hello there, Cutters. Foxy Cut Dojo here. And today we're going to be continuing work on our tank team. So, last time we started to work on the game, we got the, um, working on our tank body, your ground's all set. So, anyway, let's go back to this. We're going to come back at the, uh, a little later and uh, add all the fancy stuff for now. Our tank body is just going to be this little block. But don't worry, of, we're not going to be doing this all the time. But anyway, let's move this. Eight hundred. Shave. Oops. That's too much. Six fifty. Two fifty. Three fifty. So for now, it's going to be right over there. And now what we're going to do is basically we're going to just copy and paste this real quick. And now this time it's going to be a bit longer. So now that we got that, or what we're going to do is... Yep, we got that all done. Where should ah and now we're gonna do tank turret equals new tank turret six hundred three fifty two fifty oops sorry get there made a mistake and now tank turret dot Display. All right, all right. Need to make this reflect the change. So I'll modify this real quick. There, that looks somewhat like a turret. Five fifty. Raise it a little bit. Okay, so again, this is just mostly placeholder stuff. This is mostly just to test how everything's gonna work. So anyway, let's continue. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna start the rotation. So rotate the turret. If key is pressed, up arrow, console.log test it just to make sure that everything's working. Oops, not key is pressed. Key down. Key is down. <laughs> Everything works properly. So now next up, what we're gonna do is tank turret. We're gonna create a new method. And now this one is gonna be called rotate up. Now, what we're gonna do is mat matter dot body dot set angle. This dot body is what we're gonna change, and now we're gonna set the rotation to this dot body dot rotation plus pi divided by three sixty because this matter dress uses radians instead of uh, degrees. So that should give us a good change. So now we'll do uh, tank turret dot rotate up. And give me one sec. I see what I forgot to do. So over here, we're not uh, changing our display in any way. It's always just gonna be the same. So now what we're gonna do is translate. First we gotta push. 
And we're gonna up. Now we'll change this to zero, this to zero. Now we're gonna rotate this sub body dot rotation. I was expecting at least one argument, but it only exceeds zero. Let's just put this in. One without that. This dot body dot. Okay, we're gonna go back. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go here. And we're gonna do tank dot body now you can check all of its properties and it's dot angle not rotation that's what I was doing now so this dot body dot angle there we go it turns properly everything's going all right but um let me sh uh let's do one thing real quick Let's say we make this a little bigger. 275. There, and now we need to just do a little bit of shifting around. Oops, a bit too much shifting. <laughs> Okay, and now we gotta raise the turret as well. So that, oops, wrong way. Now, 15, 17, 18. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna bring it forward a bit. And we're going to display this over underneath. So when we turn upwards, um, that doesn't really look right. So now er, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do matter.body.translate this.body. Now we're gonna use a vector. A vector is basically a way to show an x and y position. So this is one on the x, we're gonna change it at one on the y. That's basically all it is. So not what we needed. So now we're gonna try, we're gonna just work with this a little bit. Some small changes. Need to go a bit farther back. Oops, I'm going the wrong direction. So now we can experiment with that a little bit. To see how we like it. So point one five. So I'm happy with that. Now what we need is rotate down. And now for this one, use give down, down arrow, rotate down. Oops, I uh, forgot to make some adjustments here. And there. We'll need to do a little more work on adding a little cap so I can't go past a certain amount. But yeah, that works well. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Uh, can't wait to see you next time. Okay.